So one day there was a little boy named David. He was a shepherd. He had like a blue band like around his head and he had like this kind of like a dress but like for boys. He was young. Look, just look after sheep. And sometimes maybe cut the sheep to make sure they're all there. And he rescued lions. No, I mean, um, he killed lions <laughs> and bears. He once fought a bear <coughs> with his hands and killed it. He was brave and he was strong. He was brave, strong, and he played. David's dad um, was told that the Philistines were coming to attack the Israelites, but David, because he was the youngest, um, his dad said he can't, he can't go, so David's seven. Um, seven brothers went. They were really scared to go on one side of a hill. And it was called Bethlehem. The F Philippines came to fight. They wanted to see who's the strongest. Goliath challenged the Israelites for 40 days, but no one would challenge, fight him and accept the challenge. And a few days later, he, um, David was told to bring food to his brothers. And then Jesus came and to bring pizza. So Goliath, he's got like a pointy hat on. His like golden hat was um, like covering his whole eyes. He's very stinky and he's got short brown hair. He's got lots of armor, he's got lots of swords. He walked like a big giant. He didn't. He he had to. He had to. He had a big moustache and no, he had to a big beard. He doesn't have a moustache or a beard. <laughs> but he was angry. He was really angry. The Israelites were were too scared. Goliath shouting, "Send me your best soldier, and I will." to fight him and if he wins then we'll be your slave and if we win you'll be our slaves. They wanted someone really really brave to fight them him but they all were too scared because he was way bigger than them. And David was the only one that wasn't. Well I will fight you. King Saul said to David um, how are you going to kill Goliath? And David said, I've, I've um, fought lions and bears to protect my sheep and God has protected me through those times, so I know that God will protect me through this. Well, David said he would and the king didn't think he could, but he tried, so he put heavy armour on him. But David just said, I don't need it. Sometimes it's you don't have to be big and strong to be the best. You just even if you're small, you just can be. Sometimes you're just good in your heart, which makes you different from everyone else. So God came to David and said, "I will be right beside you. I will make sure that you'll be protected and you won't die." Mm. Yeah. He has a swim slide, so do you know how he got the rocks? He got from the water, clean ones. And then he put one stone in his sling, and then he um, um, spinned it around and around and around. He threw it at Goliath and got him right between the eyes. <laughs> and then he was killed. And then all the other... Philippines ran away because they were scared. The God was scared because I thought he was going to win, but he was not going to win because they but won. And all the Israelites cheered like, yeah, 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 we won. And then he, they would have picked David up and went on his shoulders just like, yeah, yeah. And that was the very end.